Hey, you guys, stick around to see how I got this New Year's Eve ball-inspired look. Hey, you guys, it's Steffi. How are y'all doing? Um, happy New Year's Eve, Eve. Um, this next look could be for you New Year's. This is a look um, inspired by the, the ball at New York, you know, the ball drop thing. Um, so it's going to be a lot of glitter. It's right here. I'm so excited. It's a holograph glitter look, and this is for my girl V. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put on my eyeliner because you know how it is like almost impossible to put on eyeliner after you put on big chunky glitter. So I'm going to go in with my gel eyeliner. And will I do a V? I'll do a V for V. Oh, you know what? I should have put on my silver eyeshadow first, but that's okay. I'll get it done. I'm going to do a little wing. Can't do too much of a wing with my uh, gel eyeliner because of my hooded eyes. So I'm just going to do a little bit of a wing. I don't usually use gel eyeliner for wings, but it's coming out better than I expected it to. Ah, that looks pretty good. Pretty good. I'm getting better at these wings, I'll tell you guys. Oh, and I'm gonna do my top and bottom, bo ugh, top and bottom water lines. Maybe I'll do, maybe I'll just go all out today and do like bottom lashes. We'll see. Yeah, I totally should have done my eyeshadow first. I don't know what I was thinking. I was just so excited to get this going. So if you guys do this look, don't do it in the order I did it. going to go down on my lash line a little bit. That will help to hide like the glue and stuff for the bottom lashes. All right, now for the eyeshadow. I'm going to put on a little bit uh, where am I going? I'm going to go on to my, so my Revolution Soap X palette. And I'm going to put on like a, like a medium, medium shade like this. Just to, um, you know, have, have like a base all over. I'm going to put that on in the middle, on the top crease. and also down below. There's glitter going here, so it doesn't have to be perfect. This look is all about the glitter, y'all. I'm so excited for this look. I'm so glad that V, I'm pretty sure it was, yeah, V, she's my girl. I know her in real life. She's cool. Um, this is her, her request. So I'm very excited, very, very excited. Hey, and let me find, I'm going to go in with a silver pigment. I think, no, nope, that's not it. Oh, it's stuck in here. This is Farah, I believe. 
And this is a silver pigment. And I'm just gonna go in where I'm gonna put the glitter, which is pretty much all over. I'm gonna put it here. This is just in case the glitter, I miss any spots with the glitter, then there'll be like a silver background. So it doesn't look too, you know, like chopped up. This is a very pretty eyeshadow just by itself. So my anniversary is tomorrow and I would like for you to tell me it's also New Year's Eve. So I'm going out to dinner with my husband. We have been married for five years now. We've been together for 10. Uh, he is a wonderful man. I can't, I can't say enough good things about him. He's just amazing. He's been amazing for me through all of my shit for 10 years. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, so I want you to tell me, guy, tell me which New Year's Eve look you think I should do, whether it's this one, the black and silver, the rhinestones. Um, Y'all let me know. I would really appreciate if you would let me know what you guys think. What am I doing? I think it's time for glitter now. So I'm going to go in with my NYX glitter primer. And I'm going to go, oh, I think I'm running out of this. And I'm just going to go all over my eyebrow, eyel uh, eyelids where I'm going to put the glitter. So it's basically all over the silver area. And maybe a little bit above. I think this is the best glitter primer I've ever, well, I've only used two. The first one was for like uh, glitter lips and it was very, very, very sticky and gross. And this NYX primer is not like that, so. All right, so I need to pour this into something or I'll just dip my, oh, there's something on there. I don't know what this is. Like something blocking the oh there it goes okay all right so I'll just stick my brush into here so I'm gonna take a flat fluffy brush and I'm just gonna stick it I'm gonna put it like in the middle because there's so many like large chunky um, glitters on top that I want to get to all of it like the the small ones and I'm just gonna pat that on oh you guys Oh my God. Oh my God, this is so pretty. Can you guys see that? Oh my God. This is probably the sparky, sparkliest glitter I've ever used. This is beautiful. So I'm just gonna pat that in to the uh, primer so it doesn't like fall down my face. And I'm just going to pat the edges, kind of blend it into the brown. Oh my God, that's so pretty. Ooh, that is some shiny glitter. Oh my God. I don't know, this might be the look. I might just decide on this one because this is beautiful. So it's either between, it's basically between this look, the black and silver look, 
and the rhinestone look. Those are my three favorites. But this is fast becoming my favorite. This is so pretty. And I'm just going to pat that in there into the primer. I thought there would be like too much chunky, like big chunky pieces, but there's a good mixture of all of it. I love this. I love this. All right, I'm going to wipe this brush off. And now I have a little bit of glitter on my eyeliner part, so I'm just going to take a Q-tip and I'm just going to gently rub it off. I have one, a big one over here couple of big ones over here. Uh, you know what? Let me go back over this with my eyeliner. I kind of figured this would happen because I put my eyeliner on first. I just need a place for the uh, eyelashes to stick, you know? They don't like to stick to glitter. Especially big chunky glitter. Oh my god, this is so pretty. All right, now I'm going to go in with the eyelashes. Let me glue them up. I'll be right back. Come on. Now this look calls for some big fluffy lashes. I'm not going to use my biggest and fluffiest, but I'm going to use something close to it. Oh, I got some hanging down. What is that? Oh, it's a hair. Oh, God, it's got my whole thing. All right. Oh my God. Okay, so I'm gonna take like a big fluffy brush and I'm going to kind of try to blend this out on the outer side. Just kind of want the smaller glitter up there so it kind of blends a little bit easier. God, look how pretty that is. All right, and before I forget, I'm going to do this on my inner corner with some highlight. It's all about shimmery and sparkly. Okay, now what? Now I think I'm going to go in with some bottom lashes. This glitter is like overtaking everything, like even my eyelashes. I'm going to have to go over it with some mascara. Okay, I'm going to go get some bottom lashes. I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm going in with a couple of bottom lashes. But you know, I've been thinking. This is a pretty big look. With pretty big bottom lashes. And pretty big glitter. So I'm really thinking that I need pretty big top lashes. You know what? Every time I put on my bottom lashes it goes fine until I get back on camera and then it's a disaster this is a true story okay um yeah I think I'm definitely gonna go with the biggest lot 
Actually, they're not even the biggest lashes that I have, but they're pretty big. I used to wear them all the time. So I'm gonna go with those after I get done with these bottom lashes. I mean, it's New Year's Eve, let's go all out, right? Yes. I love it when I get to do makeup like this, when I get to like do it big and loud and I, I love that. That's my favorite. I love it. All right, this is the last bottom lash. And then I'll go get the big mamas. All right, let me go get the bigger lashes. All right, I think we got it. I think we got it. Yes, ma'am. This is what I'm talking about, you guys. You know, this glitter looks good and everything, but I think if you really want to be inspired by the ball, the New Year's Eve ball, I think we need to go with some rhinestones too. Right? Maybe around the sides a little bit. The glitter is very pretty, but I think we need to like do it if we're going to do it. You know what I mean? So, let me start doing it. I have my rhinestones over there. They are my, I'm going to be using my AB rhinestones because they are very, very sparkly. And I'm just going to put glue drops all over the place. A little bit under here, a little bit over there. Oh, let me do one on my nose before I forget, of course. Now, this is very new glue. I just opened it, so we're gonna have to wait a minute. You know what, I'll get back at you when it's ready. Okay, let's see if it's ready. Let's go in with a, a rhinestone. If I can find one that's the right size. All right, here we go. Yes. Woo! My rhinestone thing almost fell over, y'all. I have it teetering. You know what? Let me just put it back over here so it doesn't fall. Y'all can see me, right? I'm just going to use a various mix of sizes. It's so hard to see though because some of these are really small. You have to pick up these rhinestones in a very specific way. You have to pick them up with the shiny part on your thing and it's when you have a million rhinestones it's kind of hard to see that if it's on the right way. Damn it. All right, let's see. Is that enough? Mm, no. 
nope not enough it's never enough i'm gonna go in with some smaller ones and kind of fill in the spaces around there's a hair come on oh. I'm just gonna fill it in with some littler ones, some smaller ones. And I'm gonna be over here by my bed because this is where the rhinestones are. All right, let's see. I think that's good. I think that's pretty good. It's pretty sparkly. So I'm gonna go do the other side and I'll be right back. Okay, so I got both eyes done and then on the very end here, I put some diamond shaped rhinestones. I think it looks very pretty. If this isn't disco ball inspired, I don't know what is. I don't know what else I could possibly do to uh, make it a, make it, not a disco ball, but the New Year's ball, except I could put some face glitter on, some like body glitter. So I'm just gonna do that like down here on my cheeks. I know you guys can't see it very well, but it's very pretty. And then also maybe put, um, I'm gonna do it down my nose. Maybe put some sparkles on my lips. I don't know, maybe that'd be too much. That's just, that's a lot. I love sparkles down the nose. I'm gonna start maybe putting rhinestones down my nose. I don't know, I just think it's really pretty. All right, time for lipstick. I'm gonna do my huge, my new favorite, the burgundy. and I'm coloring in my Cupid's bow. You know what, I'm thinking since I'm not going out for New Year's, I'm just going out for my anniversary, I might do the black and silver look. We're going out to a nice steakhouse in Orlando. Um, it's like our favorite place to eat, so I'm very excited. So it's a, what is it, a 20 ounce steak this steak is? It takes me three days to eat it. It's so good. All right, and I'm using the lipstick with the skulls on it.
You guys, I'm watching this show called Ameri My Big Fat American Gypsy Wedding. It is so good. It's got so much bling in it. It's, un it's like right up my alley. And it's also got fighting. People are trying to stop weddings. It's just amazing. These gowns that these girls wear for their weddings are just like ridiculous. In a good way. Sorry if I'm blocking you. I'm going to put like three layers of this lipstick on because it's so thin. I just realized I really feel like drinking a coffee. All right, and I'm going to run some mascara over my eyelashes and we'll be done. I think this uh, look started out, I mean, it, it, I love it started out a little crazy and i think it was just missing something and i think the rhinestones really kind of and the eyelashes really just kind of brought it all together so i'm very happy with the way this look turned out i hope i didn't disappoint v i hope this is what you were looking for I think it's I think it's really good. I would wear this to a party. If I still partied, I would wear this to a party. Or like out to a club or whatever. But I don't do that anymore. So anyway. This is the final look. How glorious that is. Very sparkly. I hope you guys like it and um you know keep coming with the requests i love doing requests so i will see you guys next time bye you guys have a great new year's